this is uh, quite a big day. So this is the first time I've been out hill walking, probably for about two months. And here in Northern Ireland they've just relaxed the restrictions so you can travel as far as you want the exercise. Um, and the advice from Mountaineer, Mountaineer in Ireland is that you can access the hills but uh, to do it locally and to do it within your means. So I travelled about half an hour to the Sparrow Mountains and the Sparrow Mountains and Antrim Hills would probably be the two closest hills to, to where I live in Antrim. And I'm at Sleeve Gallion. So this is one of my favourite walks and it's a, a nice easy walk, nice and open um, and uh, even in terms of taking some precautions I've, I've parked a wee bit away from the forest car park down at the church uh, where there's a massive car park and as I've walked up I've seen that there is a few cars parked in the road so the car park obviously has a few people at it. So I've, I've met a couple of people um, just out um, Doing, out, doing a wee walk with their dogs and stuff here through the forest and the forest is absolutely beautiful this is Inniscairn Forest and uh, again it's um, in, in sort of full bloom and full flower um, as, as we're nearly into the summer so uh, really really cool to be out here today and I'll, I'll soon be out of the forest and, and up on the open hillside for the first time in a couple of months so I'm looking forward to that It was a pretty tough climb up, uh, even though I'm out walking maybe 10 miles a day, there's a real difference to walking the hills. So my, my heart rate was really pump, pump, pumping uh, all the way up to this is the north top of Sleeve Gallion. And uh, it's a beautiful day, really, really warm, um, but stiff breeze up here, which is cooled down, so I'll probably put the jacket back on. Surprisingly, the ground's really, really dry. Uh, I suppose over the last maybe two months, there's only been a few days of rain, and it's really, really showing up here. Uh, you 
can see over to the rest of the sparrows there, that's Mullockmore Mountain. And all this lovely bog cotton, which is in, in full flower. Absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. There's Ennis Cairn Forest. So that's where I come up and that's where I'm heading down, a really, really cool forest. I don't know if you can see, but sort of around the fringes, there's um, sort of some broadleaf trees, like uh, beech and that, where they're sort of higher up and, and sort of in the middle there, it's, it's mainly conifers. Um, but looking really, really well this evening.